Is Silicon Valley a boys club and is it, how fast is it changing? Look, I mean, honestly, it, you are in a male-dominated world, and so it is kind of a boys club, but we have to give credit to those individuals that are willing to open the door and create an environment that everybody belongs. You know, when I started my career, I thought that I was going to be successful because I should just be one of the boys. And I fast forward a couple years ago, it was really about being your authentic self and bringing your authentic self to the table. That, was, that meant embracing my feminism. That meant embracing the notion that I was Latina. I spent most of my time covering. I had never told people that I was Mexican because I didn't want it to hinder my success. And so I do believe for anybody to be successful, it's to be authentic to themselves and bring their true authentic self to the table. It becomes our responsibility as females to drive the conversation and drive awareness of how an individual makes me feel. You know, one scenario, an, an executive sent me an email, um, and in the email, uh, he indicated, hey, I want to introduce you to um, another girl that I know. I'm like, why do you use the word, word girl? Mm -hmm. I mean, I would never call you a boy. And he never thought about that. Right. And his perspective was like, you're absolutely right. We don't call men boys, so why am I calling females girls? And so that's the lack of awareness. And if we can drive conversations around how individuals make us feel, and sometimes I call it like the unconscious bias, they may not be aware that mm -hmm. we are feel like we're not in an environment that we belong, I think it's our opportunity to kind of drive those conversations and let them um, be aware of it and create proper actions and put proper programs in place to help solve it. I also believe that it's going to be us females helping the next generation of young girls not give up and pursue a degree in engineering and providing them with the platform and tools to be successful. Fast forward 15 years from now, I think Silicon Valley is going to look very different. More female. More female. And more diverse. More diverse. And more, you know, also just people from different experiences. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.